hey what's going on it's Elroy coming to you from Brampton Ontario hope you're having a wonderful day um, if you're joining me please comment below let me know that you're you're joining me and let me know where you're tuning in from okay before I get started I just want to check to see if uh, my Facebook live is working because the last time I did it um, it wasn't really working for me. I did like what? I think it was like six, seven minutes or so. And after when I was finished, there was no Facebook sound. There was no sound. So, ouch. Yeah. But, um, yeah, it seems like it's working now. Okay, cool. So, yeah, if you're joining me, feel free to comment below. If you're watching the recording, I appreciate you. Thank you for watching my videos and um, I'm going to share some value with you today. And um, yeah, and it's titled, uh, you have to discover your prospect sign, right? To increase um, sales and sign up in your business. Okay. So if you're in network marketing, affiliate marketing, um, whatever business that you're in to get um, sales and sign ups, I mean, in any business, you have to get sales, right? So you have to discover your prospect sign all right so so i'm gonna get started okay so if you're just joining me feel free to comment below uh give me the likes shares or whatever but um yeah it doesn't matter what business you're in okay you're in sales <laughs> okay there's a lot of people says oh they're not in uh in the sales business maybe because they have some bad experience with a salesperson right or uh, whatever the case is right but we are in sales doesn't matter who you are right but you have to know how to sell <laughs> right there's no way around it you gotta sell right so there are two ways to sell right and um one is to force it down your prospect uh throat right you know oh here uh join this take a look at this you know buy this buy that you know you know that approach right now how many of you have tried that <laughs> right we've done it before right but it, it's a part of the journey we all make mistakes and uh it's very important that we're corrected and the other way is creating an eager desire for wanting that person to uh to want what you have to offer okay and that's when you're gonna have to figure out their sign okay and before i get into the content today okay there will be a training uh tonight okay if you're a person who is scared of actually approaching people um to talk to them about your business i know there's a lot of people they are fearful of what people may say or think about them or you know they don't know what to say you know they um they're scared of rejections, you know, this training is going to help you, all right? It's uh, going on tonight at night. My buddy Matt is going to actually put on a great training that you could uh, actually leverage the internet to get um, sales on autopilot, okay? So if that, if that interests you, definitely, I think there's a link above this video, um, elroyd.com forward slash training, okay? And get registered, save your spot, all right? And make sure you show up early, all right? So I'm going to dive into content right now, all right? So... So um, let's get started. So the sign, right? S-I-G-N. All right. So the S stands for strength. So if you're talking to someone face-to-face um, -face or you talk to them online, all right, you have to figure out their sign, okay? And um, I'm going to break it down for you what the sign is, all right? So you can start implementing it in your business today, all right? And um, so the S stands for strength. Okay, so when you talk to people and you're building that rapport, um, you know, you got to figure out what they want, right? And in order for you to sell what you have, you have to give them what they want. And uh, you have to figure out what they want before you give them what they want. Does that make sense? <laughs> right? So I'm going to break it down for you. So the strength is, I mean, what are they good at? You know, like, um, for example, when you go for an, a job interview, right? Um, they interview and ask you questions. That's a discovery to see if you're a good fit for the job offer that they have, right? So that's the same thing with the business and your prospects. You definitely, because you are the boss, you are the person who has the authority over them. So you have to um, take control of the conversation, okay? So you got to ask them questions because if you don't 
know what they want or what they're good at, how are you going to know if it's a good fit for them? <laughs> All right. Does that make sense? I mean, if you're getting value from this, you can share it. Give me likes, thumbs up, um, whatever. Right. But um, so, yeah, you got to figure out what their strengths are. OK, figure out what they're good at and to see if they're good um, for your business opportunity or your products or whatever it is that you have to offer. OK, and I is for interest. OK, you know what interests them? What what do they want to learn about? You know, do they want to learn about marketing? Do they want to learn how they could create um, time freedom? You know, do they want to learn how they could, um, you know, quit their job or something and and travel the world and, you know, experience all the other worlds around all other countries and stuff like that? You know, you, you, when you gather these information about the prospect, now you know what to um, to point them to. You know, so G stand for goals. OK, so we're at G. So goals, you know, what is this person want to achieve in their life? You know, do they want to um, I don't know, do they want to quit their job? Do they want to, um, you know, do something special, give back to the world, you know, um, be able to have enough money so they don't have to worry about going to a job or do they want to um, I mean, if you're in weight loss, <laughs> right? I mean, do they want to lose, I don't know, 50 pounds or something by by um, by the time the winter's done, right? So they could have that beach body to go on that beach and hang around with a computer and stuff like that and have a sexy body, right? So when you know that, just say you have a, um, a weight loss product. Now, you can actually um, sell them on a weight loss product because you know that they want to lose weight, okay? So if you don't know they, if they want to lose weight and you're actually offering them weight loss product, then it's going to turn them off. So it's very important that you find out what what their goals are what they want to achieve in their life all right so that that way you can use it as your advantage at the end okay does that make sense if it makes sense comment below and say hey i got it <laughs> all right so the n stand for needs all right now what's important to them right what is important to that prospect that you're talking to you know is it like uh man is he is he in a situation that, man, I just need to do something different? You know, what the person is doing right now, it's not working for them and they're looking for a solution, which it could be your business opportunity. So maybe they want time freedom. I don't have to, you know, clock in and go to a job and, uh, you know, just work for 40 years and having to retire for nothing. Right. So when you gather all those information, then you have a good idea what this person is all about. Right. Or if, if he or she is a good fit for what you have to offer. Right. And that's when you actually uh, could qualify and disqualify people because you don't want to be the one who's um, want to work with everybody. Right. Because everybody is not a good fit for what you have. Right. So that's how you have to do it. You got to figure out their sign. OK. And when you figure out their sign, then you could know where to lead them to, whether it's your product or your business opportunity. Does that make sense? I hope you're getting value from this. If you are, please comment below and let me know and you can share it with your friends as well, all right? So, so with that being said, that's it. You just gotta figure out the sign, um, get to know people, you know, when you, when you have um, an interest to get to know people and what are their interests and what they want out of life, then that builds trust with your prospect. You know, they'll be like, oh, man, this is a person that really cares. Right. And that's when, that's when the people want to be like, man, I want to work with this person. And now you don't have to chase anyone to say, hey, sign up. Hey, buy this, buy that. Right. <laughs> so that's just like a sell without selling approach. Right. You don't want to just force it down the throat of your prospect. All right. So you will just turn them off. All right. So you definitely do not want to do that. All right. Because that's what most um um amateur do right they they just spam all over that's why most people um say this home based industry is a scam right because people keep on spamming people now you want to become a professional all right and and start to in, um start to interview people you know get to know them build a rapport Man, it's not simple, man. It's it, it's a process, but you have to follow it if you want to succeed. 
All right. So again, if you want to learn how you can actually, because there's a, there's, a, there's actually another way that you can actually uh, generate sales online. You could do pro, uh, face-to-face props, prospecting on uh, social media, or you could do it automate, uh, automation online. All right. So, so if you haven't already done so, there's a link above this video. If you want to learn more about how you can leverage the internet to generate leads and sales online, you definitely want to head over uh, to lworldwide.com forward slash training. Okay, and register for the training tonight. It's going on at 9 p.m. East, I believe, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Okay, so register. Um, make sure you show up early. This is only a thousand attendees, okay? And it really fills up really fast. So you definitely want to show up at least, uh, I don't know, five to 10 minutes early to make sure that you get your spot. Okay, so with that being said, this is Elroy White. I appreciate you. Thank you for listening. And I hope you have yourself a wonderful day. All right, say bye. All right, take care. I'll see you in the next Facebook Live.